Hi everyone, this is Keith from rckeith.co.uk. In this video, we're looking at the uh, time lapse build of the Flying Shark and its first swim. It did say on the box it needed some adult supervision, but I thought, what the heck, I'll take a chance. And uh, I did that to get an adult occasionally to come in and help me a little bit. Uh, the build isn't too bad, uh, it's more awkward than anything else. Um, I did struggle a little bit when I first got it connected up because it uses infrared and uh, I thought this thing's not working very well but then I realised I've got my fluorescent lights on and as soon as I switched them off everything kicked into life. A, a big thank you goes to all the guys at Transaction Network Services in Sheffield. Uh, I've just recently retired from work at the end of 2017, a few years early and the guys knew I was into me flying. Uh, I used to bore them to death with me videos at, at work. Um, so I was there three and a half years and as a leaving present they bought me this. Uh, so thanks very much guys. As promised here's the uh, video I said I'd do and I got it working. Um, luckily one of the guys at the flying club where I fly, uh, the Rotherham District Model Flying Club, uh, Melvin, had a big uh, canister of helium because to start with I thought where I'm going to get this from um, so you, at the beginning you can see the canister where I'm filling it up uh, so but thanks very much to Melvin and uh, I'm sure he'll have a laugh when he sees this video It does take a little bit of getting used to of how to uh, uh, fly it, basically using the control to flap the tail at the back. And you can see in our sun lounge at the back we haven't got, <laughs> haven't got a great deal of room. Um, but you can, gradually get used to it. Uh, this one here is attacking me. As you might have guessed, this is going a little bit faster than normal. Uh, uh, speeded this part of the video up. <laughs> now I wonder what the dog thinks of it. Let's bring him in and let him have a look. <laughs> Don't think he's quite sure. <laughs> more interested in what's outside really. 
So thanks for watching guys and a big thanks to the guys at Transaction Network Services and to Melvin for supplying the helium free of charge.